Alawa versus Queen of the South Scottish Championship it's the halfway mark of the season 18 games in and Alawa still have an excellent chance of being a championship side next season today's opponents Queen of the South are battling for promotion playoffs but at the first game at Palmerston Alawa blew them away in 25 minutes with a quick fire treble the Queen's talisman Stephen Dobie inspired the Free side to fight back and his hat trick got them a draw Today for the Wasps, they named one change to the side that drew two all in Glasgow against Partick. Liam Dick is unavailable, so John Robertson slots in at left back. Queen of the South is suffering just now with his one single victory in the last five league games. And no Stephen Dobie for them. A couple of other injuries means they name only five substitutes. Alawa to get us underway, shooting into the railway end of the endo draw. Kevin Colley robbed by Jacobs. Ball forward to Dykes. Driving at the Alawa defence. Gets faced with a shot. Left footed. Barry will collect that easily though. Jordan Marshall. Send in the corner for Queens. Headed into the danger area. Barry comes up. Ball is in the back of the net. But ruled a foul on the Alawa goalkeeper. Flanagan, free kick into the middle for Zanata. He heads it off the bar. So close for Alawa taking the lead. Mercer, thrown into Dykes. Mercer, over hits it to Dykes. Chip in from Jacobs, down to Josh Todd. Can only scoop the ball wide though. taking quickly Zanata can't get round the Queen's defenders hasty his turn and just to make some space behind Marshall has a shot and Alan Martin has to be quick to get out to Alan Trouton Robertson launches the ball across field towards Scott Taggart Dario Zanata ball just breaks Alan Trouton through on goal He's missed anyway, wouldn't have counted offside. Corner delivered in by Queen of the South, Andy Graham heads it away, Josh Todd on the edge of the area, it's going top bag! Neil Parry, what a save, how many points is that man worth? Corner, and at the back post, Robertson, Todd. Picks up on the edge, he dives over Kevin Colley's ankle. Mercer. Bell loses out to Flanagan. Beautiful through ball with Dario Zanata is just body checked by Queen of the South captain Callum Fordyce. Yellow card for him. Flanagan. Free kick! Quite close enough. Hetherington. Zanata turns, can play in hasty. He's got Kevin Colley in the box. He's ruled offside. Jake Hasty going to early. Flanagan. Colley. Shepard it out. Flanagan though can pick the ball back up. Plays it wide to Hasty. It's a brilliant low save from Alan Martin. And eventually, Queens will clear. Marshall. Headed into the box by Fordyce. It's into the London Dykes. Got to enter the ground. Neil Parry didn't know much about that save. Queens corner. Mercer. What just in at the front post to Parry? Unbelievable save. Callum Semple this time. Hetherington. Driving forward. Picks out Dario Zanata. He drives into the box. Whips that ball across the face of goal. Too far ahead of Trouton though. Hey, 
Parry. Sends a kick long into the Queen's half. And there by Jake Hasty. Takes on Owen Bell, drives past them easily. Three Queen's players around him. Can find the ball in the box. Kevin Colley as well gets his head to it. Can't direct it towards goal though. Mercer. Back post for Queens. Callum Fordyce got his head on it. Easy taking the end for Parry. Colley to Hetherington. Oh, it's a beautiful wall through. One on one. Jake Hasty taps it home. Only to be ruled offside. Hetherington. Forward to Hasty. Beats his man with his touch. Plays it wide. Robertson. Keep it in the middle. Zanata. Caught by Kyle Jacobs. Flanagan. With a free kick! Scurls it bottom corner. Ignores the ball this time. He's good at putting it up and over. He sends it straight in that bottom corner. Alan Martin can't get anywhere near it. Seeing Flanagan's seventh goal this term. It's an excellent return from midfield. He's Alba's top league goal scorer. Parry launches the goal kick. Headed up in there by Queens. Eventually, Stephen Hetherton can knock it down to Kevin Corley. Oh, breaking on Queens. Kevin Corley, though, goes for the shot from range. Makes a bad contact with it, and the ball trundles out for a Queens goal kick. Ball picked up by Roscoe. Zanata pegs his man. Sprays that ball to Alan Troughton. Back to Zanata, driving through on goal. He's taken out in the box. Referee just ignores that. For me, that's a penalty. Callum Semple charging into him, knocking him down. Flanagan. Back to the middle. Ball headed on by Zanata this time. Too high. Taggart launches the ball. High in the air. Queen's head it back into the other half. Todd. Corner Murray heads it forward. Dylan. Lyndon Dykes running onto it. Thankfully, he's not connected at all well with that shot. And he sent it wide. Huge let off for Alawa. Murray. Goes for goal himself. He's the left footed shot. Straight into Neil Parry's hands. Queen's free kick just on this halfway line. Sent in the other way to Jan Boggs. It's Michael Doyle who gets his head to it. He sends it narrowly wide till the other go. Jacob's giving away cheaply to Flanagan. Brown. Tag it wide to him. Played into Zanata's feet. Oh, some fantastic footwork! Makes himself half a yard to get the shot away. The on loan hearts man though can't double Alawa's advantage. Oh, Sent in the middle, Andy Graham heads it on. Oh, wide with Marshall. And the back post is met by Fordyce. He wins the header again though, can't send it on target. Parry. Ball launched long, in for Zanata. The but reacts quickest out of anyone has a goal going bomb corner Martin saves and Zanata the quickest off the mark falls up immediately taps home to make it Alawa 2 Queen of the South now it'll be Alawa's third win of the season it's been well deserved Liam Burt and loan from Rangers he's been unlucky with limited appearance so far this season but instant impact from him He's unlucky not to score himself. Queen of the South still pushing for some consolation in this game. Ball into Fordyce. Doesn't win the header. Comes down to Josh Todd. Fakes the overlap. Plays the ball and Fordyce gets his head to a parry again. Instant reaction. Manages to save it with his leg this time. Launched up by parry. All the way through to Alan Martin. 
team. Surely up here. What a full team. Alawatu, Queen of the South now. It's a brilliant result for the Wasps. Alawa climb above Falkirk and Partick to hold that 8th place safe position into Christmas. The results elsewhere saw Alawa's rivals lose to Dundee United and Ross County respectively. The Fairland drew with air as Lauren Shanklin drew blank. The table makes good view in as form goes. Alawa better form than Dunfermline, Queen of the South, Partick and Morton. It's not too much of a stretch to look up at those teams of ours. Next week, sandwiched in between Christmas and New Year is Dundee United at the Emlo Drill. Join us for that on Watch TV.